Eastbound traffic on Highway 1 in Langley was shut down for hours today. The reason? A bizarre accident that sent a dump truck crashing through the side of an overpass. Our Michelle Brunoro is live on 202nd Street below Highway 1 tonight. And Michelle, talk about a close call for people underneath there. Yeah, absolutely. Police say it's very fortunate that no one was injured in this. This roundabout here can actually be very busy at that time of day. And that trailer fell from the overpass just in behind me. When it came down, it narrowly missed a driver who had just gone through here moments before. It's hard to imagine how part of a dump truck trailer ended up here, dangling from the Highway 1 overpass onto 202 Street. Crazy, crazy. This man narrowly missed being hit by that trailer. The fact that it fell from the sky is what sort of freaked me out more than anything. It all began around 8 this morning. A dump truck heading eastbound lost control and crashed, sending the truck's trailer flying over the highway cement barrier. The trailer's frame was left hanging, but the box itself dislodged from the trailer and came smashing down onto the street below. I heard a mighty crash behind me and uh, turned around and there was a tractor, end of a tractor trailer just lying on the ground. So it missed me by probably one second. He says the impact of the trailer hitting the road literally lifted the back end of his truck off the ground. The accident shut down Highway 1 eastbound for hours, snarling traffic as crews worked through the morning to clear the accident. Engineers are on scene. Right now they're trying to figure out how to safely get this trailer down. At this point it's been dangling here for about two and a half hours. We had uh, some issues with some live wires there for a time. Um, those were disconnected. Eventually, the trailer box is slowly lowered to the ground. Police are trying to figure out how this happened. It's still under investigation at this time, but uh, initial witness reports say that uh, speed uh, was a factor. Whatever the cause, Tony Bray only needs to know he escaped a bizarre crash today by mere moments. That's amazing. That's amazing. So how, do, how does that miss me by one second? So, and something flying through the air, it's just crazy. Tony Bray, very lucky. Uh, Michelle, uh, what do we know about the driver of the dump truck? Well, we know from police that the driver is 56 years old, that he was taken to hospital, not because he was injured in the crash, but because it was believed that he was in shock. Now, he has since been released. I spoke with a friend of the driver. He tells me that the driver uh, told him about the crash, that he has more than 20 years' experience, and that, um, according to the driver, when he was driving this morning, the sun was in his eyes, traffic had slowed down. Uh, when he tried to slow down to avoid them, he ended up losing control of his vehicle. Now, all of this, of course, under investigation. Police, as indicated in that story there, said that they are looking at speed as a factor and say that the driver could face charges. Mike? Thanks, Michelle.